Dapper uses components to abstract and integrate with various infrastructure services into your applications. With over 100 components, you can connect to a variety of PubSub message brokers, state stores, bind to external APIs, secret stores, and more. However, configuring these components can be challenging. Each component has unique connection properties and different authentication mechanisms. Developers need to dig through the component reference documentation and copy-paste each field to get to the right configurations. Diagrid Conductor solves this problem with the new Component Builder feature. This tool provides an intuitive and guided interface to configure your components without the annoying YAML formatting errors. To configure a component, select the component type you want to configure and the concrete backing service. Depending on your selection, you will be offered the available authentication profiles. In this example, we will use Sazzle. On the next screen, we will fill the other general properties, starting with the required ones. For Apache Kafka, these are the component name and the broker URL. On the right-hand side, we can also see all the optional properties that can be used with this component. For Apache Kafka, there are plenty. I want to consume all messages starting from the oldest one, so I will set the initial offset to oldest. On the Assign Access screen, we can assign this component to a specific namespace and scope it to specific apps. Conductor assists us by letting us browse the connected Dapper clusters to see the namespaces and apps. Here, I will set the namespace to default and select only one of the apps. In the final screen, I can see the generated YAML file and, if necessary, still do manual changes to it. Once I'm happy, I can download the YAML file and use it locally or commit it to a source control system. Sign up for Conductor today and start configuring Dapper components faster with the Component Builder.